So the first thing we need to do in telling Microsoft to f off is once you get to this screen, make sure you do not have a LAN cable plugged in. If you have a LAN cable plugged in, it's going to skip one of the magic screens and take you right on through entering into your Microsoft account. So make sure you don't have one plugged in. Then we need to hit Shift plus F10 to bring up the command box, click inside of it, and then enter the following command and press Enter. Once you hit Enter, the system will restart and go back to the same first screen. Now as far as regional locks goes, there are ways around them through VPNs, but not here. So go ahead and select your region and then obviously your keyboard layout. Now I'm pretty sure there's no way to skip the keyboard layout either, but why would you want to? And now we're at the screen where the command that we entered earlier comes into play. If we didn't enter that earlier, we wouldn't have this button right here that says I don't have internet. So needless to say, go ahead and click that button. Now giving it a profile name is not optional, but this is not an actual Microsoft account or anything like that. This is just a local Windows profile that it's going to boot into whenever you start your computer. Which brings us to the magical trick of bypassing the password requirement. And to do that, just don't give it one. Yep, that's literally it. Then either leave on or turn off whichever one of these you want to, hit next, and you're home free. And you're also now safe to go ahead and connect your LAN cable or connect to your Wi-Fi once Windows loads. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more tech tips and build videos. And if you're interested in your own custom PC at a great price, head over to BeEasyBuilds.com and contact us today.